Hi everyone. Normally, I rely on SAC sends, those messages that I send out on emails about what's happening on campus, what's affecting us, what's happening in the country, what matters to us. Today, we decided that we needed to be more personal. We had a horrific event in Sacramento this past weekend. An event that hurts and will hurt for a long time. A shooting that took six lives that put 12 people in the hospital that affected literally hundreds of individuals at the scene and thousands who watched it on TV and in social media. The taking of lives is never right. The loss of lives hurts and it directly affects the Hornet family. We are an anchor institution. We are part of this community. We are only strong as this community is strong. And today, the community hurts. And so does the Hornet family. We need to support each other. We need to support everyone in this community. Obviously, we need to end gun violence. This was not the only shooting in the last few weeks in Sacramento. Three children lost their lives in a church. In a church. We have to come together as a community and heal and be strong for each other. We here at Sacramento State must support each other and we must support our loved ones and our friends. We have to do this together. If you need help, we have the resources at the Student Health Center. We have the EAP program. But more than anything, we have each other as fellow students, as co-workers, as faculty, as staff, as a family. It's a sad day, but we've gone through so much, we can continue to not just survive, but prosper through love for one another. So, Hornet family, let's stay together. Let's support each other. Let's be there for each other. Normally, I would end this by saying, Sac State is number one, stingers up. But that's not right. Not now. Right now is the time to say thank you. Thank you in advance for being there for each other. Thank you for being part of the Hornet family.